What's up guys and gals? I had a bunch of comments and questions about this trap when I put up that picture of all them bullheads in there. There's probably about a hundred in there after a one night soak. And where I'm throwing it, it's pretty common. This trap isn't new. I saw it on YouTube a couple years ago. I, I think they call it a Z-trap. Anyways, uh, it'll outperform a clover leaf, hands down, in my experience. I used to run them clover leaves and they work fine, but for some reason these things, you know, I'm talking twice as many for some reason. Um, as far as measurements go, 24 wide, well, it's basically a 24 inch square, top and bottom, and you've got 12 inches tall. This opening here, 10 inches. That one's roughly six, and this one's eight. Um, openings, I've got, and then, you know, this is just the way I do it. I don't know if it's the right way, the wrong way, whatever, but it works for me. I've got two openings in here. And they're, let's see, two, three, four, five squares. So two and a half inches tall, two inches wide. And it's on the bend there, so you can squeeze that and adjust it as far as width. But I've got another opening up top here. There's two on each side. And then I've got a little door here. This one's not complete, clearly. It needs a whole bunch more than chancy tie wraps and a few more beers to complete. But the other side, same thing. Um, that's where I kind of made the seam of the of the two pieces, you know, because it has to wrap all the way around. It's all one piece. But use what you have. This, this is just what I had. It was long enough to do one. Same thing, two openings. Uh, adjust it to your bait size as needed. Uh, I trap bullhead, bluegills, carp with this, and it works just fine. But yeah, super cheap. You know, it's come from Home Depot. I think it's got some rubber coating on it that's a little nicer than uh, than the normal mesh. Seems to hold up a little better when you leave it in the water. You know, I use it quite a bit. So, uh, as far as bait, I use uh, I'll throw like a corn cob in there when that's available. But just white bread, any kind of bread, dog food. I mean, I'm sure a lot of you guys know this stuff, but this is what I use. Uh, and seems like the older the bread, the better when it comes to them bullheads. But dog food works. I really haven't tried nothing else. I haven't really had to. I've been pretty fortunate to do pretty good with it. So that's it. Um, any questions, let us know. And try to help you out but uh, it's pretty much all I know about it and it works well later